Hey everyone, what's up? Everly here, and welcome to my Sims 4 Realm of Magic Let's Play Part 2. So Hazel just got off of work, obviously, and she's with her cats, and now she's sick, so that's great. That's, that's fantastic, actually. I want to go to the magic realm with her today, so let me see. Where is... I probably can't even see it. Purchase gifts. Why would medicine be in gifts? But it is, so that's always very interesting. Where is it? There it is. I just saw it. Yeah, why would you give medicine to someone as a gift? I don't understand. But regardless, please take some medicine so you feel good. But yeah, she is a sales floor clerk now, which I'm super happy for. And she's even happy. She's like, yeah, I'm proud of myself. I am too, sweetie. So she's a retail employee number two now, and she has to reach the charisma skill of level two. So she's got to do that, but since it's getting late, and after Gigi uses the toilet, you nasty, I want her to actually go to that portal and see that other world, because I'm so hyped. And since we've got a good chunk of money right now, I'm thinking maybe when she gets home from the Magic Realm that we can possibly get some more things and or upgrade our appliances because we don't have the best. I would really like that really nice fridge or stove set that come with this pack. So yeah, or maybe we'll need something that pertains to being a witch. I'm not really sure yet. But, yeah, um, sorry, that is my dog, if you hear her, she, she's barking in the background, well, a little bit, so hopefully that's not too annoying, I'm sorry, um, if it is, let's change you into your regular outfit, your beautiful outfit, come on, change, or don't. What's going on? Okay. Uh, what's wrong with you now? Can you guys stop for one second? I want to go. Okay, I'll give you some pets and some loves, and then I really got to go, okay? There. Okay. Once you're done with that, we are actually going to go now. So... I actually came across the Magic Realm portal a couple times. Whoops, not that way. But yeah, I've come across it a couple times. And I actually had her visit once just to look at it, like I said, when she was drunk. But here it is. So I would like you to go over here, please. And then I want to go into first person mode so we can see what she sees. Uh, no thank you, we're actually going somewhere. So yeah, she's super excited. Well actually, she I'm more excited than she is probably. She's probably just very curious about it because like I said, she was drunk when she first saw it. Um, and so she's probably like, it's not... I just want to see, is it true what I actually saw, or was I just seeing things? I really want to know. And so that's what she's doing. So she's like, I'm just going to check it out to see if it's actually there. She's running. Okay. Alright. It's kind of a ways, actually, which is pretty cool. But yeah. Why are you so sick? Oh no, she's tired now. Uh, we don't even have enough points. Uh, I hate that. Mm, maybe she could get some rest in the magic realm. 
Yeah, maybe there's some benches or something there she could just sleep on. I know that sounds awful, but like, I'm sorry, I want to go. <laughs> so you're going to have to deal with it. But yeah, let's go in first person mode and see what she's seeing. Okay, so hold on. Um, let's do... Okay. <gasps> Look at that sunset, though. That's so pretty. Uh, Alright. Let's hit play. Let's do this, and then this. Alright. There we go. It would be nicer if she walked, but she's running. So, yeah, that's cool. Look at those cherry blossom trees. They're so pretty. Look at how gorgeous, though. So, she's gonna be going... She just runs right through it. I wish uh, the Sims would have a... I don't know, more of a reaction to seeing this portal. Like, if it was in real life and I saw a portal like this, I would be shocked. Not just like, oh, see, she's just playing on her phone. I don't know, it's a Sims thing, though. So, get off your phone, please. And now, let's do it. Ah! I want to get a good angle on this. <gasps> That's so cool! That's amazing. The swirling vortex appears to lead to a realm beyond your own reality. Do you dare cross the threshold? No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Heck yeah. Who would be like, nah? Nah. I don't feel like it today. Maybe another time. Like, who would say that? Like, I'm all for fantasy and... I like, I like reality, obviously, but... Uh, I love fantasy, so I would never, like, not want to take that chance, I guess, is my point. So, yeah, we're just waiting now. <gasps> okay, here we are. Okay, the magic room. Sorry about the whisper. <laughs> but look, that's so cool. It has the, uh, the houses up there, I think. So, what does she... Is she... <gasps> wait, 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 girl. Girl, come back. Who are you? Carl... Carly? Early. That's a cool name. Oh, she's getting no skill. But see, she should be, like, in awe, like I am. But what are you gonna do? So, she's in the magic realm. Wow. Can she do anything as a mortal? I don't think so, but I still want to check it out. Cook mac and cheese. Yes. Uh, let me see. I just I just want to look around. So he has this thing over his head. Does that mean he's a mage? Or like one of the head people of the... S s yeah, you say... Okay. So, Morgan is a knight. I mean, sure. Uh, that's not really what I expected, but yeah. Hip bump him, yeah. Just come into the magic world and just be like, Hey, I'm just gonna hip bump you. I know we don't know each other or anything, but like, I don't care. Is there... Mmm... The stained glass. I love the stained glass. Okay, so up here. All these are the same, it looks like. Yeah, they look all the same. Okay, so what is this? Nothing? Okay, that's cool. Um... So this is where I think I saw some YouTubers their sims were like dueling in here so that's cool and then there's one down here and so this is the sage of mischief magic and he or she she yeah she is a knight too oh there's another level wow there's a lot of levels in here but that's cool. Where's the third one? Because there's supposed to be three. Or maybe I missed it. Oh, it's right here. Sage of Practical Magic. Simon Silver Sweater. 
Wow, that's a lot of S's. And so he's in the same kind of rig out. Okay. Well, is there a bench? Well, I guess this is kind of a bench. Just nap for a little bit because you're so tired. And while you do that, I'm just going to look around because, wow, this place is beautiful. The water's kind of gross. I know it looks green to me. And so, ugh, that is not something I would like to see, but hey. And then there's another portal. Mmm, look at those crystals. Er, wow. Yeah, they're so pretty. And those plants, too, they're pretty cool. Okay, so I'm going to fly over here. What's that? What is that? It's... How can you... No. What are those? The sounds they make. Wow. What are those supposed to be? I don't even know. Huh. I know, sorry, I keep saying I don't even- Can you please leave us alone, please? That's all I'm asking. Oh, there's the bridge that's broken. So that's cool. I wonder if you could fly to these islands instead of taking the portals. Because that would be really cool. Who's this? Martha Brewster? Okay. So this is the town area. It sounds so magical. Who's this? Marcus Flex? And Dustin Ebanks? Okay, so by wands, tomes, and familiars. By brooms and crystals. Awesome, this is so cool. I know I've only, like, seen a little bit of it, but I really love the world. It's very beautiful. Okay, so... Ooh! That's magical. Hot realm of magic. Ding, ding. Um... But that's cool. That's really cool. There is another place I think I'm forgetting. Um... Because isn't there four islands? So this is where we were. Is there an island over here? No. <gasps> Look, it's like on the side of the cliff. That's really cool. Um, oh. Are those, um, I don't even know. I just want to look around. Uh, that's the place, I think, that we haven't seen yet. But wow, it's gorgeous. I think there's supposed to be some, um, what's it called? Uh, not shooting stars, or maybe shooting stars. Hmm, more crystals. Okay, so you better now? Okay. Oh, someone was sitting by you. Alright, there's our friend who was extremely mean to us in the first part. Ooh, what's he doing? Like, girl. Like, if you saw this, you would definitely want to stick around for it. Like, wouldn't you? That's a giant spoon. Oh, she teleports. She's already magical as is. She doesn't need any magic. She's already magical. Okay, so... I don't know. I'm wondering who she should talk to so that she can become a witch. Um... Should she talk to Morgan or that girl or that other girl? I wonder if it matters or if it doesn't. Mm, ask how to use magic. The magical sages are the only spellcasters that can bestow their power onto other sims. Okay. Interesting. 
I think she would go to this person. Practical magic, maybe? And he's the closest, so. Hello. Maladay. Maladay. <laughs> Poor soy. Uh, Why don't we get to know you a little bit? Uh, how about talk about how you were just in Glimmerbrook and then you stepped through this portal you didn't know existed and now you're in here and now you don't know what you're doing? That's a great like conversation starter. So he's a geek. That's cute. That's cool. Oh, brain his day. Um, talk about the warm temperature. Ask him if he's a mermaid. Definitely. Definitely. I kind of want to just cause. You a mermaid? Are you a witchy mermaid? Things about cats. Mermaid would give you that idea. You just don't understand. It's kind of funny. Tell a funny story. Okay. Can you like get out of that outfit? I want to see what you look like. That would be nice. Uh, other Sims. Ask to see outfit. Ask to see your everyday. Just because I don't really want to talk to a knight. No offense. Or anything. I just like to see what you look like. Because we've seen knights before. So. But it would only have to happen in my game, though. All these weird things happen. Please change. Please. Thank you. Oh yeah, he's one of the guys from the trailer that everyone kind of got upset about because apparently he doesn't look anything like he did in the trailer. And I can see, yeah. Yeah. Maybe I'll give them a makeover or something so that they look more like the people from the trailer. Um... What do you think of Morgan? Just curious. And then I'll quit stalling. Johnny Zest is here? Yeah. Dina Caliente? Um... Not exactly who I thought. You're tired again? I haven't had the... But... You're... Okay. Whatever. Fine, you could sleep a little bit longer. And then we are getting on this magic hype, okay? I just thought it would be a little bit more realistic if she at least knew the guy a little bit before he made her a witch. Because, I don't know, it seems kind of unrealistic if you just walk up to... A person you don't even know and then you're like hey I want to be a witch can you make me a witch I know you know you don't know me at all but can you make me a witch so I want her to at least talk to him a little bit so once she gets up and it's going so slowly then she's gonna ask for um, how to use magic so yeah and then hopefully do they have do they have any bathrooms? I was even really paying attention. They have a bathroom. They have a shower somewhere. And then maybe she can cook some mac and cheese on that cauldron. Uh, is there a shower down here? No. Um, yeah, there is. Okay, perfect. Okay, good. You're awake. Now it's time to ask him. So how do you use magic? Random guy. <gasps> it's cool. She's like, whoa. Okay, so now what? 
Do we have to do something for you, like a quest? Learning the magical arts is a wonderful and per per perlius perlius. Oh my gosh, journey. Are you sure you are prepared to become a spellcaster? I was born ready. Uh, maybe later. Uh, I was born ready. Okay, what happened to her eyes? In order to... She's focused. Temporary moat sight from the magical sage. While moat sight is active, you can find and collect floating moats in the magic realm. Keep an eye out for them. I don't know what that is, but okay. In order to bestow the gift of magic upon you, I will need seven magical moats. I have granted you moat sight in order to see and retrieve them. Search the realm for moats and return to me quickly before the spell wears off. Okay. So we got like a time limit of eight hours. That's that's plenty of time to find these moats or whatever they are. Is this it? Is it a moat? Yes, it is. Okay. Well, uh, why don't you use the bathroom really quick? Because we got eight hours, so we got time to kill. Obviously. Uh, go take a shower. They're probably going to be like, you can't use it here. This is inappropriate. Please stop. That's how I think some of the sounds sound. This is inappropriate. Please stop. And then maybe she can cook some mac and cheese real quick. And then she's going to be tired again. Like I swear. So there we go. That's pretty cool. I'm glad they actually give you a quest or something to do instead of just giving it to you. Like with um, their mermaid kelp. And, um, or no, it wasn't Mermaid Kelp. Was it Kelp? Yeah, Mermaid Kelp and Island Living. Like, they just give it to you. And then, poof, you're a mermaid. And it's just, I don't know. I want to see how you would cook in this thing. I'm just curious. And that's the shower. This is what I want in her house. I want the uh, pretty toilet. Uh, and a pretty shower. That's weird saying a toilet's pretty, but you know what I mean. Okay. Oh, I'm surprised she didn't get yelled at. Maybe it's a community lot or something. So how does this work? Okay, that's... wow. What is she... It's cooking, okay. I don't know, I thought it was magic for a second. Like that's a lot of mac and cheese. I mean, that's a huge container. So you would put a lot in there. Well, I guess we're feeding the whole of the magic realm. I mean, this thing's huge. Okay. <laughs> She's like, this is tiring work. Oh, that's cool. They made a little swirl action. Or, um, interaction. Or animation. Oh my goodness. Sometimes I think I just get tongue-tied. Oh, hey, Morgan. Oh, nice. So what you doing? I'd rather watch you, not gonna lie. No offense, Hazel. What you doing? Just practicing? Would you like some mac and cheese? That's the true question. Oh, wait. Whoops. You're not even Morgan. You're, uh, El Fabia? Whoops. Eh. Sorry about that. And she's tired again. I can't even, uh. Well, you know what? You're gonna have to suck it up once you're done with your mac and cheese. I want you to go find those, uh, what are these called? Moats. I want you to collect those moats. How many do you have to collect? Five hours? Oh god. Um, seven. Okay. Girl, you need to finish and let's hurry this on up, okay? So there's another one. Oh wow, they're all over the place. Wow, that's awesome actually. Well, kind of awesome, kind of not. I don't know. 
because then it makes it very easy to find them. So, mm. but then again, I think with the um, the things you had to get in Into the Future, those were kind of close by too, so you knew exactly where to find them. But still, how do you collect them? How do you collect them? I'm very curious. Uh, oh, I missed it. Okay, are you collecting them? You just grab it? Oh. Okay. Um, collect this one. Then collect this one by the fairies and collect this one. Oh, someone's writing. <gasps> I want to see that. Come back. Where'd you... What is that? Oh. Okay, how many does she have in her inventory? Okay, so she's got three of these. So she needs seven. Okay. What's this? I need a glimmer stone. I think that's something you need to be a spellcaster, so I'm going to make sure she keeps it. I know you're tired, and you're still eating your mac and cheese. you got to love a multitasking queen over here. Eating her food and collecting the stuff she needs. Queen! Okay, so where's that guy? Got to find him. Or does it matter? Oh, there he is. Turn in moats. She's dead tired. Oh my gosh, she has work in about an hour and she hasn't slept since. Sorry, girl. Please forgive me. But this is more important than your job. Don't. Hopefully, no job employers are listening to me because that's bad. <laughs> Probably to say. Mm, now what? Okay. <gasps> okay, now that's cool. <gasps> wow. Hazel is now a spellcaster. You can follow her veil view her spell book by clicking her perks panel or by clicking on the button in this window. <gasps> Oh, heck yeah. Okay. Oh. Wow. Okay. The Schools of Magic. Okay. Practical Magic. This is the one I never want to use because I feel like it's too powerful. So I'm probably never going to use that. Just to let you guys know. Sorry about that. Mischief Magic. Untamed magic, alchemy, yeah, I was thinking of maybe not doing alchemy either, I don't know, you guys let me know, because I was thinking maybe a daughter or so in the future, or just one of her kids could do that instead. A spellcaster is nothing without their trusty spellbook. Every incantation, ritual, and elixir that a spellcaster has learned is recorded here. A spellcaster can learn new spells and potion recipes by reading magical tombs, speaking to sages, or by practicing magic. Oh, so there's more! Practical magic. Okay, so sorry about that. I had to help my mom with something. As I was saying, though, um, I think I was reading... Where'd the spellbook go? I just... <laughs> oh, wow! Spell cast your charge. Regular in this range, all magic behaves normal. No additional benefits or dangers. <gasps> That's cool. And then this is her tree, or spell caster perks. Wow. Okay, this is so cool. I'm so excited about this. Um, where's her spell book? Um... Where'd it go? I actually don't know. Uh, okay, I'll open the spell book. Um, 
Yeah, I was just looking at this, I think. Or I was reading them. So, practical magic. A practical spellcaster studies all things helpful and useful. Life is much easier with a bit of magic. Okay. So, I guess, like, household kind of related things. So, that's cool. Like, that thing, I think, is repairing. Cleaning. Maybe food. So that's what I'm just guessing from the little pictures. Um... The schools of magic. The spell a spellcaster is a spellcaster is defined by what they learn and study. What kind of spellcaster are you? Okay. Okay. Um. Uh, mischief magic. A mischief spellcaster loves nothing more than tormenting others with magical pranks. Why take everything so seriously? Okay. Untamed magic. An untamed spellcaster dictates themselves to only the most powerful and uncontrollable spells. Oh, so this is Morgan then. Magic is a force to be controlled. Okay. And alchemy. Also, a student of the alchemy. A student of the alchemic. A student of the al. Chemical arts studies potions, elixirs, and tonics of all kinds. Who knows what power can be brewed up by a skilled spellcaster? Okay. And then, like I said, you can learn more, apparently. So that's cool. That's really cool. Oh, I'm so excited. I, I can't wait. Okay. So do you have any wants, now that you're a spellcaster, to be alone? I mean, yeah. Anything else? No, of course not. Um, so then if I click on her, <gasps> magic. Open spellbook, practice magic. Familiars. Familiars. Hazel does not have a familiar bond to them. Okay, so then would I have to go home and, like, become better friends with my cats? And then they're a familiar? I'm not really sure how it works. And sorry for um, me going all over the place. I just wasn't sure how. I wasn't sure how everything worked. And so everything was happening for the first time. And so, yeah. Sorry if. I got a little annoying. Search for tombs. Okay. Right. She can read. Right. Um. Broomies, Cooking with Moats, Darley Porter in the Basement of Shadows, Witch Witch, Bewitched, Witch Witch, oh my god. No. Experiment, Brew Potion, okay. Mm. Dush Apprentice and Nephroite, Nephroite? Okay, so she still has this mood lift for three hours, and then it just disappears, I guess. Um... Is there anything else you can really do? Do you need to catch some of these? Maybe. Maybe they're important to spells, so maybe I should have some, just in case. Um, I don't know what's really useful in spells. Um, I guess I just have to find out what's this. What is it? It's a parsley. Maybe... Maybe we need some of that? I don't know. I'm kind of picking up things that I think we might need. Why didn't it... Does, can she not pick them up anymore, or did you just decide not to? Okay. Crystals. I wish it said... Um, what? Oh no, she needs to go to work. Hold on, hold on. We'll get out of here in a minute, okay? Um, so, um, let me see, learn a spell. The spellcaster's journey would not be complete without access to an arsenal of very potent spells. Search for tombs in the magic realm or ask powerful spellcasters to teach you their secrets. Good luck. Okay, can she take one of the books? We might just steal a book. Like, sorry, not sorry, we're just gonna steal. 
Do you see that guy over there? <laughs> what was he doing? Um, uh, I'm just gonna steal this book. That's okay with you guys. Um, or maybe she has to look for the tombs. Here, search for some tombs. Um, we're gonna call maybe a vacation day because she is not gonna be okay to go to work. <gasps> They're dueling. Oh my goodness. This girl will not leave us alone. <gasps> oh my gosh. This is so cool. I gotta see this though. Okay. You're kind of in the way, buddy. Just saying. <gasps> Look at their wands. <gasps> Everyone's watching. She should definitely watch, too. <gasps> she made him fall. Gunther Munch. Can <gasps> watch Magical Duel. What, you can't search for tombs? Girl. Oh, they finish. Have you found anything? I guess not. How about now? Did you find anything? That's how I look when I look for books. I put my hands on my hips and I lean forward. Erba. Did you call in? I didn't even check. Uh, no. What is wrong with you? Wait. I'm confused. Maybe it's a glitch. I don't even know. Are you going to find something or not? Why is this taking forever? Like, honestly. Can I just buy it? Like, she's taking forever to find these books. Like, honestly. Like, if we can buy them at home, that would be so much easier. Um. Or should I just... There's kind of... Is this it? There's different books. <gasps> Finally! Oh my gosh, that took way too long. Way too long. Okay. So she at least found that one. Um, maybe we should get some really quick, 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 quick. Um, okay, there doesn't seem to be any more right now. Harvest the parsley. And then I know you're like collapsing and then we're going home. At least she found what she needed. But we will be back extremely soon because this place is amazing. So, yeah, just get some parsley and then we're heading home, okay? Is this the portal home? Return to Glimmerbrook, yes. So go get that parsley. Go get that parsley. Oh, I think I heard a raven. Or something. Okay. Alright. Bye bye. Oh, same. That that would be me if I tried to <laughs> fly on their broom. That would be me. Actually, I probably would never really fly on a broom because I'm afraid of heights, so I don't know. Would you guys fly on a broom if you could? If you could be a witch, would you be a witch? Let me know in the comments below because I'm curious. I definitely would, a hundred percent. Being a witch is something I've always wanted uh, to be since I was a kid, as well as a fairy. So, yeah, I definitely would. Okay, you're probably like, wow, what a day. Like, honestly, same, though. Like, that would be my face if I saw all that magical stuff and then... I came back, and I would just be, like, overwhelmed. So let's get you home. Hopefully, find odd jobs. Why does it seem like I don't have a job? 
Like, I don't understand. But yeah, she's not going into work today. So you should just head home. Okay? But yeah. Let's... Let's go back the way we came. Oh, now she's walking. So now you get a nice view of it. Oh, what is that? It's like a banner. Huh. I've actually not seen that, I don't think. We're just gonna stare at it. Okay. Cool. I suppose. So she's gonna take a while probably to get home. So, yeah. Too many buttons. <laughs> Too many buttons, okay. Let's get home before you collapse. She's probably going to collapse in the doorway or something. So, yeah. We're just going to head home. And then I'm probably going to end this part here. Mm, okay. Rank apprentice teaches the reader of a spell to make something or someone squeaky clean. Okay, so it's a clean spell she has, I guess. Oh, yep, she's collapsing. I always thought it was hilarious that they have their butts in the air. Like, who who falls asleep like this? Uh, how are the kitties? Aw, uh, they're good. Okay. Go home. I'm trying to go home. Wait. I have to go home again? I guess. I guess. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to teleport you there, I guess. Because you're going to take forever to get home. So let's just go home. Okay. But yeah, I'm super, super excited for this uh, Let's Play. And wow, that was... A really cool journey for the small part that we had for the small part that we had it was super fun and I'm so excited for her to cast her first spell and she's actually a witch now hey we can even make the litter box maybe shiny now um and so maybe next part I will actually do something with the house because I feel like this part has maybe been an already pretty long so yeah that's what I'm thinking um and then yeah so now Hazel's a witch that's very exciting I'm gonna just have her go to bed afterward or maybe she should at least feed the cat because she might be out for a while, so I'll at least do that. And then, yeah, we're just gonna speed this up a little bit. And uh, Gigi doesn't like the toilet, it seems. Alright, there we go. All the cats are taken care of. Please don't wake us up. What? Oh, the Romans just. There's... Um, no thank you. There's poop in there, and then when I touch it, it disappears. I love that glitch. So, yeah. She's just sleeping. I don't want you to sleep too late, because then your sleep schedule is going to get out of whack. But yeah, I think you're, you're good enough for now. So why don't you wake up has some food and then we're gonna end this part off right here um have a ham and cheese sandwich why not and then watch some news and then we're gonna end off this part here girl don't be slamming stuff you're gonna break something <gasps> what's this oh no I knew it was gonna no! She didn't even touch it! What are you talking about? She didn't even touch it! I, I guess she did. But I literally didn't see her eat a single bite. I knew it was going to come in and bite me in the butt. Because she's a vegetarian. I just knew it. Um, 
You know what? You get a PB and J then. And then watch. Can you please not? And then watch some. When I hit news, okay. I'm sorry. I just I knew that was gonna happen. Hopefully she won't throw up. Hopefully. Okay, she's good. She's good. Whew. All right. Like I said, I'm sorry. I, I knew I was going to forget that you're a vegetarian. I'm so sorry. But yeah, she's just going to eat. And this is where we're going to stop the video. She's just going to have her food. And so, if you like this video, please, please show the like and subscribe button some love. Yeah, she's like, you better. <laughs> I'm just joking, you guys, but, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it, I'm sorry that I was all over the place, um, I was just very excited, and I didn't know what I was getting into, because, like I said, this was the first time I ever experienced anything, so, um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time, probably tomorrow, for the third part, alright, I love you guys, Bye bye